he might not even have a manifold. This Toyota has been doing laps, and we haven't worked out why. There's a dog. Here he is. Look at the Lupo. He's got all of his shopping on the roof. Oh, not tonight. Maybe later. <laughs> You can taste your ears. I can taste uh, something. That's from not that. normal. <laughs> the mic has had taped up grill and triple racing stripes and a makeshift snorkel. Look at that. It's been cut into the car and it's just guttering. We have a safety man. He's racing the Clio. The Clio's losing. The Clio lost. What is going on down there? Has someone got like a club stand flag? They're holding it out. I'm going to have to investigate what they're doing. So are we choosing which cars yeah. deserve? That. <laughs> yeah, the Audi was not accepted. No. They approve of the white chaser. Everyone loves the white chaser, that's why. What? There's a mic ripper. What? This guy's got some sandwiches for us all. What's in there? Pasta. Pa pasta? Yeah, pasta. I, I, literally, I've been rinsed. I've got nothing left. <laughs> it's me! <laughs> what a cute that's the car whose wheel fell off. We can't find the wheel. A tenner for who can find the wheel. I'm off. Have you seen a wheel? He hasn't. It's getting a bit pond-like down here. Apparently, did he float? If it was that a magpie? It could have seen the wheel and taken it. Have you found it? <laughs> they found it. Where was it? Go click. Hey! Can I found two more Oh, brilliant. That's all you need. Oh, Lee is on the mic now. And we're going to be choosing the best dogs in those categories. Look at that strut. Is he a horse or a dog? No one knows. What? What? Yellow car. Where's the yellow car? Oh, there is a yellow car there. Look, a monkey. Oh, a pasty. A pasty. Oh, a pasty. Yellow car. Oh, which one? Out of a heart. <laughs> Sorry, the yellow say Chloe, who's this? Or a ghost? Or... It's, it's a ghost, I think? It's a Volvo limousine parked by a, a flashy Mercedes. Like a stick. Oh, the yellow car. Where? <laughs> uh, focus there with black stripes. Oh, that's mean. Yeah. Oh, look, Billy Ray Cyrus is here. Yellow car. Where? Lotus Exige. Oh, it's mean. Oh, frog friends. <laughs> and someone's gone to the effort of putting a BMW 1 Series body on this Tesla. Oh, look, we've got a Bentley with a TT body kit. Oh, no! <laughs> I've broken loose. <laughs> what? <laughs> He's doing a burn out on some grass. Uh... <laughs> We've got three slushies. Oh, that's disgusting. <laughs> There's an Audi RS4 with a bear driving and a man dressed up as a banana. And then this rusty Mercedes, I believe it's a CLK, with very brave front wheels, not quite as well, almost as brave on the back, bright green high vis on the front, smiley face on the center cap. But honestly, guys, what is happening? to the UK modified car scene. There's a small Coca-Cola crate. There's part of a kid's floor mat with a Ford Sierra. Rubik's Cube on the top of the roof. Inside this Renault, these skulls are having intercourse. Oh no, they're not, that's a dog in his lap, my bad. Next to the VXR, we have this hand-painted E36. This particular one has a shower underneath it. Do you think it's safe? It is connected, I won't I won't try. Oh there's an iron on, on the spoiler as well and, and some ducting on the exhaust. It's made of wood, the spoiler, if you can call it a spoiler. It's an ironing board. It is a literal ironing board on the back of the E36. And then we come to the Nissan Sunny, which presents a bit of a Buzzazuku style with this exhaust. We have some inflatable things by the Car Girl Culture Club. Further down, we've got this beautiful artwork on the side of the Puma and some donuts on its bonnet, just down from Pigeon, the X type. The MX5's got some hula flowers and a flamingo on its bonnet, as well as an inflatable alligator. We've got a slip and slide set with a dolphin and some bananas. There's a white chaser which everyone loves with a parrot, also inflatable. The Fiesta has a parrot, the R34 has some hula stuff on it as well. The Volvo's got a beach ball, the EK9's got a parrot, beach ball on the Fiesta. That is crazy, they've got the metal bumper on the front, it's called Beatingu. Oh, I have no idea how to pronounce that, there's, there's too many consonants in there. The Flamingo is atop a Toyota Hilux, quite a high Toyota Hilux, and then there's a chain that they're just chilling on. Watch the wiper. <laughs> 
And further around, we have an off-roading beetle. It's been lifted, it's got the off-roading knobbly tires as well. Oh, there we go, there's one way to do it. Caution, work in progress. Oh, look who we've got in the Fiesta. Clive and Gels are in the boot. Look who I found, it's Harold Davidson. Oh, he's very in love with his car, isn't he? These off-roaders are doing some off-roading and this Golf has been sliced in half so that it can be a trailer for the back of the Volkswagen Golf. Oh, he's died. It's such a big car, it's taken that long to clean. He has literally died whilst wiping it down. Could we suggest we have the biggest fans of The Walking Dead here? The whole car has been wrapped. We have another off-roading beetle. There's a RAV4 with many rusty areas around it as well. Unfortunately, no zombie body parts are kept in this vehicle overnight, which luckily I don't think to be a lie. The windscreen wiper is a skeleton thumbs up. We've got this safety tape around the excitable exhaust on the back of this. But it's all right, guys, it's all right. Your approval is not required. I'm gonna sign the cozy coupe. Let's, let's go YouTube, let's put another arrow. We now have Patrick Starr on the Audi. Oh, I've been told to look out for... Ah! Noz! It comes out the front arch! So this panda is having a snack. There's some bamboo that's fallen down. There you go. There's an actual panda! I told you, they, that is a rare spot. A panda with a Stella. Careful, don't don't choke, you're, you're endangered. Who's this? I'm gonna call him John. He looks like a John. He's probably he's probably Ben. Hi, Ben. That's fun. Well done, Ben. That is a killer whale on the killer Audi. It seems I've found some kind of horse racing section. They've, they've made up... I don't know what they're using as horses. I can't work out if someone's revving over there or having a barbecue. Well, there we go. Give us a sausage. Okay, guys, we've got some very tall girls. Eight foot, are we reckoning? They've had a growth spurt. What's going on here? And then this E60 BMW. That, oh, it's a Corsa. There's a 190E called Harold with some flowers. We have a Mercedes limo dancing right in front of our eyes. There's actually no one inside. I don't know how this is happening. Oh, oh my God. Jesus. It's not a luxurious limo. And here's something a little bit different. We've got this split screen camper dragster oh that's been squished but most importantly this mini over here that looks like one of those hot wheels cars that you can get like this it's displaying the dashboards the seat has come with it and then obviously the bonnet's gone up as well to display the the something oh i see they have won quite a lot of awards yep it's bouncing <laughs> next door to the colorful van which is incredible in itself we have an even more incredible humvee the biggest one i've ever seen with a gun on its roof. Oh yeah, and I, I bought feathers. Look at him, he wobbles. That's the find of the day, go and show off the wobble. That, that's him, 30 quid, best purchase of the day. Oh, here we go. Put your artistic skills to the test. Please keep it clean and nothing rude. Could you hold feathers up so I can kind of copy him? Chloe, do you want some brie? There he is. Oh, you've given him a gun, have you? <laughs> <laughs> this is a 2016 car, so it's obviously not natural rust, he's made it rusty. Kermit's holding on for dear life. Um, I don't know why there's a filter there. Is that is that actually part of the exhaust system? Oh look, the exhaust has a flap. I'm not entirely sure whether these chains are road legal, but the car's got number plates. Let's have a look at this E36. It has an SR under the bonnet. But that's not everything, because if you come around the front, it's an S14. So it's an S14 front end on an E36. Is that forged carbon with gold flake in it? What is going on here? Jockeys? They're just massive. This isn't small. They're just really tall people. I'm not Adam C. I'm Adam C. Adam C. Oh, I'm Adam C. I'm Adam C. Adam C. Adam C. Adam Adam C. Adam C. Adam C. Adam C. We have another Adam C. Are you Adam C? We're all Adam C. Oh, we're all Adam C. I need... Oh, some Japanese ladies talking to me. What's her name? You can name her if you like. Um, Mary. Mary. There's a bit of a race going on down there. Or chase. Don't know what they're doing. But most importantly, everyone loves a green tractor. It's not even a tractor, it's a Peugeot with brave wheels and this as an exhaust. And a teddy bear! Bam, 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 bam. It's the Mad Hatter on the bonnet of the Mini. How about that? That is a BBC K series, mate. And over there, we have the Stig. I wonder what car he's got. Stig! 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 There's a Suzuki Cappuccino. Do you reckon he drives? I don't think... Oh, he's seen us. Poor Stig, he doesn't know what's going on. He looks lost. A Nissan Juke with hydraulic suspension. You can tell because, look, it's dancing. It's got a personality. Oh! <laughs> 
We have flames and look even Goodyear tire writing like the Cobra. All the way from Amazon Prime, a spoiler on the back. It's a Ford, no it's not, it's a Hennessy. Wow, I didn't know they did C-Max. A Hennessy C-Max Nismo Type R M Supra. I think it's the Mark V. Look at this contraption. What do you need to win? Um, you need a five or a zero. You've bought 15 tickets. Fail, 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 fail. Ah. Yay! Oh, some oh, schlur. Sure. Okay. An MX-5 in a colour that we all approve of. <laughs> oh look, it matches. He's got a bumper hanging out of his window. And it's not his bumper. It's the wrong, it's the, it's the car behind bumper, look. There you go, it's his bumper. You see, that's what friends are for, carrying your mate's bumper when your mate's too low to go over a road. Even the mopeds are slammed here. That's what we're all about. These chaps have got their Aussie hats on, ready for the show. <laughs> Look, <laughs> they've got like springs under the front seat, so they were bouncing inside as well. Oh, uh, what a I don't know which car said that, but that is not a standard fitment you'd see on a Subaru. Oh, check out the exhaust on the Subaru as well, and the flashy lights. Oh, well that sh shocked us. That one didn't shock us because we knew it was coming. My oh my, take a look at the Jensen Interceptor with apparently 3,000 horsepower. Thank you very much. Are we having cooling issues in the Mustang? We're also having visibility issues in the Mustang. That is a proper BMW art car. Even the dogs are loving it. I've just noticed next to the RS4, we've seen this before, the Micra with an exhaust that's taller than me. Oh look, a little love heart on the end. How nice. So I don't think that's road legal. So it detaches there and then I guess the spanner is some kind of contraption that detaches as well. And what's this tasty little thing? It's a Honda Moto Compo. And what about this? If you don't know what this is, it's a A3 in K. And we've got a Nova, and just further down, a Nova. Take a look at these shoes. I've just come across this Mercedes E-Class. It's got its VIP flags, and beyond the curtains inside, you'll notice he's got a bag of flour and an Opal Nova, and he is part of the Small Penis Club. To be honest, I didn't know that existed. This, ladies and gentlemen, is a Nissan 370Z with the shell of an F-150 on top. There you go, there's its V6, 3.7 litre, you've got 370Z wheels, as a little clue. There's a man over here wearing butterfly trousers. I think they're linen, maybe? Yeah, they are. Boing, 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 boing. This chap is utilising the unique nature of the morning queues by selling burgers from his van as a C63 rolls past. Further up we have a Luxus and a GT86 with a very large collection of minions inside. Also this micro, if you didn't know, is a hybrid because it burns both petrol and oil. That is crazy! That must be on like a different chassis or something. Something's going on there. The E39 has stopped in the middle of the road. Is he breaking down there? Oh no, he's just doing what I'm doing, watching the traffic from within the boot. <laughs> Mushroom farm. The NSX is holding out his trophy for us all to see. Here's the champion. Oh, hello, mate. There's some cows in the bushes. What are they doing? Oh, these are utilising the traffic as well. Selling some fresh cherries. There's a megaphone on this Corsa for some hilarious sounds, but there's no one in it, so there's no hilarious sounds. We have this Vauxhall Astra with a very high-vis grille and quite a bit going on. We've got all sorts of colours and stickers down the side. The bonnet's two-tone. That side looks unfinished, but I think it's on purpose. Oh look! Each of these minis is a tiny rubber ducky on their washer jets. All of them do. We've got yellow, green, blue. Oh look, the Fiesta looks a bit like a shark. It's got two top teeth, two bottom teeth, actually nothing like a shark, but some kind of angry thing. The above combines blue with yellow. It's called Titch and has some above scorpions on its bonnet. It's actually Max Verstappen's car, his own personal car. He's somewhere here. We'll see him later. Oh look, isn't that sweet? Their air freshener is a picture of themselves. He's beaten some Vauxhalls, Volkswagens, old people, a Circle and a Mercedes. That bonnet must be made of steel. This particular boy has been making some smelly clouds inside the car. And inside this R33 is not an octopus, instead it's a screaming child. Oh now look at this, a slammed Renault Modus with a central exhaust as well. Don't mind if I do. Oh, it doesn't work. We got Harley Quinn, Spider-Man, and Minnie Mouse, who I think had a bit too much last night. It wasn't me. The bonnet looks like it's being held up by a loaf of bread. What an earth toy on here! Well, I appreciate that. Wide-arched Astra. <laughs> 
Okay, what's that on my windscreen? Oh, I've got a guidebook and some business cards. Is that a magnet or a sticker? It's a Peugeot keyring. This chap has height issues from inside the aero deck. That's one of those camouflage seat belts, just so you know. Well, who's gonna get the chip? Oh, you, you want the chip? He's gonna get it. He's gonna get it. Oh, oh, he wants it. He wants it. Come get it. Yes, come on. And suddenly a pigeon enters the chat. <laughs> you know what's going to happen? A car's going to hit one of them. Oh, no, no. Oh, ho, 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 ho. oh, the chip's been squished. The whole brave wheels. This Skoda has Ferrari badges on the side. There's an M Sport livery on the i3. Currently undergoing a photo shoot with the bestest of boys. We've now got this diesel say out with some graphics. Does that touch me? It is touch me, daddy. That Prius has had some patchy repair job. I want him to ring a ding a ling a ling. His Bells. Yeah! <laughs> we want the horns! Yes! These chaps are having fun by rocking their mate's car, trying to. Oh wow, it has actually got air off the ground a little bit. The police are reversing again. So are they going to go forwards once more afterwards? There we go, they've stopped and forwards again! <laughs> I don't understand policing. It's tactics. Oh, they're reversing again! Oh! Just got to get that sweet spot. No, forwards again, one more time. Is this a four-point turn without any turning? Oh, they're going back. <laughs> why? Please, someone let me know what's going on. Why are they? Why are they going back and forth? Wait a minute. That looks. That looks awfully. Ah! Look, Marv, it's me. I'm on TV. She's matched her wellies to her umbrella and her cuffs. Look at that. Here is the Porsche 962 and Supercars of London. I want to see them bump start the Evo into a drift. Yes. Yes. Oh. That was exactly what I wanted. <laughs> Oh, let me just do my duties. There you go, Morph. Why? Why do you have oh, <laughs> where, where did they come there? <laughs> Fast and loud. Oh, look who it is. It's David Beckham. Hello, sailor. <laughs> Green and cream is the dream on the Type 23 Lotus Elise. I'll put some clothes on, mate. A pink Mark 1 MX-5. Even the wheels. Maybe it's just overspray, but... The tyres and the wheels have a bit of pink on them too. And we have a Marcos who has visited the Le Mans 24 hours or 23 and a half hours. His livery appears to have fallen off. What's he got? Oh, some apples, some Granny Smiths, some broken eggs and a banana. Well, enjoy. Look at the kitties in the seats. <laughs> and a balloon, I think. Oh yes, he's strapped to the car. So this is his way of finding his car and it's gone underneath it. So to help out, there you go. No, that. It's gone back. There is a modified of our 595, which is just down from this Mercedes E-Class turbo diesel with some cheese written on the back of it and some sharpied pen designs. Oh, the kids have scribbled on the bumper as well. Lucky rub. There we go. Oh, I was thinking someone's cat had decatted himself, but it seems a bird has deburded himself. Oh my god, who's taking the wrap off my 350Z? In fact, here you go, a direct comparison. What? I don't know what I'm looking at. How has he managed that? I know he does donuts in a field. I mean, he did them at my show. This car arrived sideways. That is crazy and bizarre to see it treated like that and actually used. I think it's a little bit too much, but it's a statement piece, just not the statement you would expect. Take another look at that. That is filthy. That's not a Lambo. Oh, there's chaos again. Oh, 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 oh. I can help. We're on stop. It's stop. It says it's a red light. It says stop. No, no. Red light and a stop sign is not enough for these people. And go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> We've got bars of gold inside this vintage van. A diamond ring is treasure for life. Ugh. A goose! Mr. Nick Mason, your wheels are brave. This guy has sorted out the solution to get through the... It's, it's only got one wheel. It's one wheel drive. On his skateboards? I don't know. He hopped! He hopped over the thing! I'll tell you what, I've got a great 350Z that you're gonna love. Half a Mini that's been turned into some kind of garden feature. It's so exciting that he's literally fallen asleep behind it. He is packing a lot of fudge. This is a Ferrari F40 wrapped in matte grey. Would you see matte grey? It's not satin, is it? It's just matte. Matte grey. Matte grey. Who, who is matte grey? Does he own the car? He doesn't. <laughs> Does he not? Let's have a look at the McLaren's. Uh... <laughs>
Oh, golden. Mm, no, I can't. There, there. Yes, I'm free. Oh, look, the red arrow. Oh, they've gone. Oh. This MK Aston Martin Le Mans car has got a friendly passenger holding a GoPro inside. Nice shirt. Nice hat. Nice cone. Nice picture. Nice socks. There's a dance floor when you can dance with a dolphin. If you wanted to dance with a dolphin, you can now dance with a dolphin. No one's dancing with a dolphin. Oh, look, duck racing. They've got some ducks and some remote control cars that are racing with other ducks on other remote control cars. Oh, there's an electric dog. Oh, hello. You'll notice the helmets are in the helmet carriers, but the helmets they're using are not in the helmet carriers because they need to use them. What's an absolutely incredible lineup and a man wearing blue and, oh, there's too many people. Oh, the Michelin man's there. There he is. Wow, that is a vibrant green on the clear. Oh, they're pulling in for a coffee. His Crocs match his clear. Dump. That's what you need. <laughs> Today I've come prepared. I've got a chair. Right. <laughs> yes. Slopped. That looks like Jensen Button. Oh, it is. Is it Jensen Button in the Rolls Royce? There he is. What a legend. Oh, someone's beeping at Jensen Button. They got waved at by. It's Jensen Button. It's fine. He's a. He's well known. Is that a Supra? No, it's a Vantage. He's stuck here with idiots. Oh, oh no, that is. A, I, I'm the idiot. My bad. He's waving the flag for Ferrari. This is me now. Yeah, the Polo Revs. You held up the sign. That's, I briefly held up the sign. He's like, oh, that's my time to shine. Yes, rev it. Or don't. He's singing him. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. Revolutions, please, sir. Thank you, kind gentlemen. Revs from the touring. No revs from the touring. Revs from the touring. 10 out of 10. He wants to know what van hire is. Well, it's when you want a van but don't want to buy one. Check out the exhaust on the back of this Saxo. They're like a jagged teardrop shape, both of them. And somewhat matching the colours of the cars. Look at his shirt. Ah, right, over here we've got this lifted Supra and a lifted chair to match. <laughs> he's trying to climb up the back of the grandstand. Oh, he's climbing down. This is how desperate we are to watch the drifting. Behind this V8 Brr Audi, which is two-tone purple and a slightly different purple, we have a slightly lifted Golf. And you can sign the wing. I'll go on then. We're doing a bit of plate spotting now. We've got Cooper on the Cooper. He goes to the gym. T he oh, TikToker. Oh, here's something I haven't seen before. They've drilled a Subaru badge into the apron. There's a GTR popping flames. He is not enjoying it. He is absolutely fed up. Blow the horn. Also, further down, check out the bonnet on the MX-5. It's a full front clam shell, if you like, rather than just the bonnet cutaway. That is something I have not seen before. Crazy scenes at the car show today. Check out the exhaust. <laughs> Thumbs up to the police. No grin, no smile, unfortunately. Oh, look. This slightly marked policeman's back. I hope you're not planning on breaking anyone's neck today, sir. Honk, honk. Hey! Oh, who's your mate in the back? I'm going to call him Douglas. This MX-5 is arriving very slowly and cautiously behind the almost marked gentleman. Oh, he's shouting at the almost marked man. Are you going to tell me off if I send it? And the policeman nods. <laughs> What's an unusual plate you have? It is a female owner. Explains some of it. Someone's just done a gender reveal. Congratulations, it's a girl. This is a Wendy Lou, and don't let her appearance fool you. She is really into her rock climbing. So here we have Linda showing her face and Molly giving the finger. This has definitely had some money spent on it. It's got this guy, I'm gonna call him Sam. What do we have on the bonnet of the Astra? It appears to be a lady placed horizontally. This is actually a 70 year old woman called Hillary. She does this on weekends, pretends to be some kind of ghoulish monster on the bonnet of an Audi. The other Tigre has a lady on it. It's Margaret Patterson. Oh, look, it's Kirsty and Shannon. This BMW has a lady's bottom on it. You can't really see because it's pixelated heavily. I'm going to name her Daphne Erickson. But today I'd imagine we're going to play lots of games of what's inside your car. On today's episode we have someone's hairdo on the back of a chair. Hair on a chair. This clownser has a couple of motorbike helmets. Inside this we have a Mercedes 2.5 litre 5 cylinder diesel with a turbo. On today's episode we have a large sausage roll worth £1.99 although I'd say that's worth about 99p, it's been half eaten. On today's episode, we have a fez. On today's episode, we have some M Sports driving gloves. On today's episode, we have a lineup of a family of whatever the f 
that is. This is pretty cool. Parked out of the way. It also begins a sticker showcase. Raccoons do it in the trash. Oh, what a day. Moving as fast as I can. Driven by a broken spanner. Or in other words, a tool. It is supposed to look like this. How dare you. Loud and proud like my... Oh, that's... Okay. Don't feel lost in the matrix. Well, I don't. If you're happy and you know it, clap your... Oh. Vegans also need pro... Oh. If you can read this, I'm not impressed. Most people can read. <laughs> <laughs> Real men have curves. Plenty in this hang set. It's dirty because I play with it. Genuine eBay parts. Your stick figure family was delicious. Past you I have. Well, I doubt that. I've been a bad girl. I'm not drunk. I hate stickers. No. Oh.